I want to quickly talk to you about uh, Access Mainsoft Warehouse Management Software. In today's conversation, I really want to do an in-depth review. I want to look at the pros and cons, the ins and outs, the coding, the, the, the pricing, the capabilities, okay? So here's an overview I want you to pay attention to. So what is really Access Mainsoft? Basically, you have here an order fulfillment and warehouse management solution that is designed to help online retailers, 3PLs, and warehouses drive efficiencies across the entire fulfillment process. We're talking about the entire fulfillment process from A to Z. So if you have interest in online retailing, if you are a third-party logistics, a 3PL, if you're a third-party logistics provider, or you have interest when it comes to a warehouse management, you will love uh, Access Mainsoft. This is kind of cool because you are able to actually inject efficiency into your operations. We also love the fact that uh, this uh, software tool has uh, easy to use, uh, has an easy to use interface. So in terms of UI and UX, you really are well served if you were to go with Access Mainsoft. It is a cloud-based solution, so you, you don't have to actually uh, like uh, go to the office to actually be able to access the software tool. You can actually just access it from anywhere where you have an internet uh, access this is kind of where you have internet internet yeah network that's really cool and the cool thing here is that a lot of folks believe that uh, with uh, access means of you necessarily have to be in online retailing no you can actually also have a brick and mortar sort of store and still use uh, access means of not a problem yes it's true that originally it's built to sort of uh, leverage the e-commerce sort of uh, era but you you can you can you, you can use this software tool in other fields as well okay and so this is kind of cool so access means of simplifies order fulfillment it really enables you to automatically consolidate orders from uh, multiple online shopping platforms achieve uh, a lot of optimization across the board uh, optimize warehouse space and staff utilization and also make data-driven decisions with real-time reporting real-time reporting is kind of key here okay you also have uh, integrations i'll speak about integrations later on but you have integrations to more than 175 to 200 uh, apps, and we're talking about uh, courier apps, multi-carrier apps, and marketplaces such as uh, Shopify, DHL, and Amazon. This is really cool. So you have you have a consistent layer of efficiency across the board. By the way, boss, welcome back to the show. It's really a pleasure to have you here. Make yourself comfortable. You are going to enjoy today's conversation. Let's talk about the, fe the features here. So when you think about Access Mintsoft, what are the features I want you to pay attention to? First of all, Access Mintsoft simplifies fulfillment for online retailers, warehouses, and 3PLs, helping them realize game-changing time and cost-saving benefits. One thing I want to say here is that Access Mintsoft does a great job when it comes to giving you uh, the capabilities you need to actually optimize your warehouse management, okay? And uh, so the tool has advanced automation capabilities to help you streamline inventory management, reduce errors, and get help uh, and actually help you get orders out quickly. Okay. And so the bottom line here is what when you use Access Minsoft, you are able to deliver your uh, the the service that uh, the impeccable service that your customers actually expect from you. The only problem that we have with Access Minsoft is here is that they they have occasional glitches. And if, if basically if you have a uh, an increase in the order value in the order volume access means of things to actually have glitches when you have peak when you have a uh, peak uh, numbers in terms of order so this is something that they need to fix but overall this is uh, the the tool is pretty uh, streamlined it's pretty uh, straightforward we love that a lot so you're able to enhance productivity and gain real-time visibility into your warehouse management processes okay and so when we, when we talk about access means of warehouse management software we're speaking about a to Z, okay. I'm, I'm talking to you about all the actions, all the activities that actually uh, add value to your warehouse operations from uh, automating time intensive tasks, tracking customer orders and inventory levels, generating shipping labels to uh, simplifying client invoicing. Access means of delivers actually the efficiencies and uh, the data driven insight that you will need to actually grow your operation. Again, I want to insist on the fact that when we talk about your operations, this is not just online. Don't actually mistake the fact that you you will need uh, you, you do not have to have an online business to uh, leverage Access Minsoft's uh, capabilities. Whether you have an, an offline or an online business, you can also use the tool to actually uh, further your warehouse operations. Fantastic. By the way, boss, I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. We are having a conversation about Access Minsoft's 
warehouse management software. This is a review of the software tool. Let's talk about the value added when it comes to our Access Minsoft warehouse management software tool. What is the, 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 the value that this software adds to your operations? It can be your online operations, your online, your online retail operations. It can be your third, your 3PL operations. It can be your warehousing operations. One thing we love about Minsoft is that it really gives you an ability to view. It gives you uh, a, some kind of clarity when it comes to back order management. And you know how important it is when it comes to... Uh, warehouse management and uh, inventory management. So Access means stuff help you, helps you in terms of back order management. So we're talking about what? Back, or, back order identification, back order tracking, back, or, back order auditing, you know? And uh, so when we talk about back order, there is a, a, there is a staff component. So when we talk about staff utilization, this is kind of important because the last thing you want is to actually have uh, your warehouse generate a negative ROI. You, don't, you do not want that. And so means stuff actually help you actually prevent that. You have e-commerce management, so there is a direct there is a direct correlation here between uh, e-commerce management and uh, warehouse management. You also have inventory management. There's a strong correlation between inventory management and warehouse management. And Minsoft also also does a great job in terms of uh, tracking the order management as it relates to the as it relates to capacity utilization at your warehouse. And th again, here we're speaking about one warehouse or multiple warehouses. So. You have the an element of multi -lo multi location. This is totally fine. Recurring orders are also handled pretty well within uh, Access Mintsoft. Not a problem. You have a uh, reporting analytics. So again, what we love about Access Mintsoft is that they give you analytics. The only problem, the only concern, the only beef that we have about that we have with uh, Mintsoft is that they don't go granular enough in some in in some reports. So Mintsoft, uh, Min if you listen to us. You want to go as granular as possible when it comes to uh, certain data, so certain data reports. If you would like to know more, just let us know in the comment section, and we'll tell you which reports you need to actually uh, elaborate on. Shipping management is great within Access Minsoft. This is fantastic. They do a great job also when it comes to su supplier management. Third-party integrations. I said this before: 175 to 200 integrations into third-party uh, apps. Fantastic. Manufacturing management. And also warehouse management, great within Access Minsoft. Let's talk about the implementation here. So when you think about Access Minsoft, what is the implementation looking like? Well, the, the first thing here is that uh, basically if you want to uh, implement Access Minsoft, you can do it yourself or you can actually uh, hire someone from uh, Access Minsoft, or not hire them, but they will send you someone to actually set it up for you, and because they will provide expert assistance. Okay, that's that's kind of fine. In some cases, they can they can actually uh, recommend a third party uh, sort of provider for you, and you can actually do a remote. You can do a remote first implementation. In other words, they don't have they don't need to have their people actually come into your place to to actually get it done. It can be done remotely, not a problem. So you are able to actually get going ASAP. Okay. And what we love about this is that Access Minsoft has something called customer success plan. So what they do is they really take uh, implementation and support really seriously. This tells you a lot about uh, a software provider when they really pay attention to the after service sort of uh, part of things. In other words, they're not just really sort of gung ho in terms of making the sale. And once they make the sale, they, they don't care about you anymore. No, this is not the case with Access Minsoft. They really care all the way through, all the way through. So they will basically uh, they will work with you. They will, uh, they'll, be, they'll be on the phone. And so they, they, they have a customer success plan and they also have a customer success portal. So any question that you have, any, any anything that you have, they will actually help you out. The thing is that they understand that access means of, it's a, the tool is great, but without, the tool is also very easy to use, but without proper implementation, you can have a steep learning curve, at least at the beginning. So that's why they really want to uh, sort of, you know, be there and kind of help you out. So we love that a lot. So this is really fantastic. One thing I want to say here is that Access Minsoft, you have to understand, this is not just uh, this is not just the one software tool. This is actually a suite of tools. This is actually uh, an ecosystem of tools. Okay, you have Access Accountants, you have uh, Access Tax, you have Access Ledger, you have Access Practice Management, you have Access uh, APS Online, you have Zap Data. So Access Minsoft is just one one little little corner 
of an entire parameter. Okay, so I want you to really pay attention to that because see the thing is the way we analyze access the the so, the suite of software tools we look at it as an ERP, an enterprise resource planning software. Okay, this is what it is. By the way, boss, I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. We are having a conversation about Access Minsoft warehouse management software. This is a review of that tool. Let's talk about inventory synchronization. And I want to talk to you about inventory sync and stock feed rules as they relate to uh, your warehouse management software. It's really important to understand that if you want to use uh, Access Minsoft, you want to use it optimally, you need to really understand the rules for inventory synchronization and stock feed rules because those will, those will play an important role in terms of your warehouse optimization strategy and also in terms of your uh, your inventory evaluation, which all, as you know, will have an effect on your balance sheet because uh, inventory is a short-term asset. And if it's if it's uh, undervalued, if it's a uh, if it's not valued properly, you are going to actually understate or overstate your your financial statement. So this is why access means of really plays an pay, plays an important role. They really play. They really take it very seriously when it comes to helping you uh, with uh, inventory sync and stock fee rules. It's really important to understand that you can automatically manipulate the stock figures that Minsoft provides to any channels they have stock sync enabled using stock feed rules. And uh, so it's one of those things where every every industry is different. Every organization is different. It's one of those things where it's better to call access Minsoft and really have uh, have all questions. If you want, you can also let us know in the comment section and uh, some of our team members will get back to you and based on your, on your situation. So we can't. We can't give like a generic answer here, but it, it's important once again to have proper inventory sync and uh, stock feed, feed rules within the access means of. You got to have things like minimum base rules. You got to have maximum base rule or zero base rule, depending upon the, the kind of inventory that you, the kind of inventory valuation you want to go for. Okay. And it's one of those things where you have to actually, again, adapt the rules to your specific industry. Every industry is different. And uh, so this, that's kind of important. And don't forget also to actually upload your stock feed rules. You need to upload your stock feed rules. And then uh, it's, it's pretty, pretty, pretty easy to do to do so within uh, Access Minsoft. You have to go to you have to go to click. You have to click product extras, upload additional info. But again, if you have any specific question, one of our team members will be very happy to get back to you. Let's talk about pricing here. So the thing here is that uh, Access Minsoft does not actually publicly, they, they do not disclose their uh, the, the, their pricing. So they want you to contact them to have more information. And it's one of those things where you have to contact customer service to have a clear idea about uh, what kind of uh, pricing you are looking at. Now, one thing I, I want to say here is that based on our research, we have seen that Access Minsoft, they charge anywhere, like they have a, a, a four a four tier sort of pricing plan. That's what we call the the magic quartet and so they have entry level medium large and they have custom so depending upon the need that you have you might actually go to entry level or medium but access means stuff is not cheap definitely not cheap but it is worth it okay it is an investment and the roi it is worth it meaning that the roi is positive okay so for entry level expect to shell out anywhere from 250 all the way to 350 dollars so 250 dollars so $350, that's for entry level. For the medium, you basically are expected to shell out anywhere from $550 all the way to $750. So $550 to $750. And so entry level, you basically have, uh, you are able to process up to 500 orders per month and you will, you will benefit from all, all of, out, let's say out of the box features, including shopping cart, marketplace and courier integration, uh, integrations. For the medium, what, what, if you pay 550 to 750, you have a uh, entry level uh, sort of features plus inventory management, warehouse management, and you also have. So if you process up to 5,000 orders, then you 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 will love uh, this one. For large, expect to pay anywhere from 1,500 to 2,000 dollars, and so this actually includes everything in medium uh, in medium pricing, and uh, this if you actually fulfill up to uh, 15,000 monthly orders. 
And so you're able to also have sophisticated warehouse management. This is really cool. And especially if, if your business sells across multiple sites and or with multiple brands. So this is kind of cool. And this is ideal for 3PLs, third-party logistics, and those running multiple warehouse locations. For custom, you have to contact uh, Access Minsoft for them to actually give you a bespoke price. But this is really, uh, it, it's really like anywhere from 2000 all the way to $20,000. Let's talk about, uh, let me give you the summary here. So the question is, big question is, is Access Minsoft worth it when it comes to warehouse management uh, software tool? The answer is yes, yes. This is a legit a legit software tool. It is uh, it is worth it, yes. When you really think about uh, the, uh, like you, you gotta really make sure that your operations align with uh, the kind of services and capabilities that Access Minsoft actually has. And we love the fact that Access Minsoft is really easy to use. You, you have a UI and UX, you have a central da dashboard from where you actually uh, sort of uh, pilot or sort of coordinate all your warehouse uh, operations. This is really cool. We love particularly the granularity. Now, as I said before, there are a few things that we do not like right now. You have the occasional glitches. We we, we do not like the fact that the, the reporting is could be uh, better. The, the reporting right now is not, is not granular enough for us. In other words, uh, you know, when you manage your warehouse, when you think about warehouse management, sometimes you want to go as detailed, as detailed as, as possible. And uh, Access Minsoft does not actually offer that level of comprehensiveness right now. So those are the two beefs that we actually have. But overall, this is a great tool that we, we would recommend, of course. And uh, but if you were to go, if you were to go with Access Minsoft, make sure that you actually uh, like you you have to actually contact them because they kind of they need to help you out to set everything up. The the tool itself is not really complicated to use. It's very easy to use. There's no steep learning curve. However, the beginning, like the first, the the, the, the first few hours of, or the first few days, maybe for, for your team to get used to the whole tool, you might need to have to have somebody from Access Minsoft kind of help you out. But overall, this is a great tool, and particularly we would recommend it for we recommend it to uh, businesses that actually operate when it comes to 3PL third-party logistics, or if you have an online business, let's say you are you do an online retailing. You will love that. Or if you're listening to me right now and you you happen to operate multiple warehouses, you will love Access Minsoft because of the automation, uh, the automation uh, capability, but also because of the uh, efficiency that Access Minsoft actually uh, inject the inject into the whole operation. What we love also is that we love the fact that you have integrations. That's really wonderful because think about it: you have 175 all the way to 250 integrations to. Uh, very key third-party apps everything from shopify all the way to dhl all the way to usps ups and so and so on and so forth so this is really cool thank you so much for your attention i really appreciate it. in today's conversation i was just talking to you quickly about access minsoft this was uh, access minsoft uh, warehouse management software review so let me do a, a quick recap here. So I spoke to you about, I give you the overview, the features, the value added, the implementation, the inventory sync, the pricing, and the summary. Thank you so much. God bless you. I'll see you next time. Until then, remember, stay marvelous.